Love is God. Live in love. Om Shri Sai Ram, welcome back to OMS. During the 1950s and 60s, it was customary that Swami would call all the ladies during the Dasara celebrations, give them vermilion, turmeric, bangles and a blouse piece in order to make them offer it to Mother Goddess in the form of Kumkum Puja. Seeing all this interest of Bhagwan in making the ladies do this Puja, Swami's sister Venkamagaru had a doubt why Swami being a man is taking so much of interest in all the activities of these ladies. This was just a passing thought. She had the privilege of sitting inside the Bhajan Mandir in the first row towards the wall. One day during the Bhajan session, as Swami sat on the throne, Venkamagaru glanced towards Bhagwan. Lo and behold, it was not Swami who was present there. It was Raja Rajeshwari sitting on the throne, decked up in that beautiful silk sari with all the ornaments, with that nose stud, with a rich crown, with the vermilion on her forehead and that dazzling resplendent form. She fainted and then the devotees next to her took her outside the bhajan hall. She had the darshan of Raja Rajeshwari. The incident did not end there. Venkamagaru and Parvatamagaru, Swami's sisters, had the rare opportunity of serving food to Bhagwan every day. One session, when she was still in this feeling of whom is she seeing? Is it the mother goddess or her brother? With that doubt still in her mind, she went to serve food to Bhagwan. Swami with his beautiful smile, sat in the chair and then Venkamagaru was hesitant to look up and glance towards Bhagwan, and then Swami lovingly called her Venkamma, it chudu and then Swami started lifting his robe up and telling Chira chudu, Baunda. In that condition, Venkamagaru looked up very very hesitatingly towards Bhagwan, and what did she see? Again, the same resplendent form in the red silk sari with that big zari, with that vermilion dot, with all the ornaments decked up, with that beautiful dazzling crown, that resplendent divine form of Raja Rajeshwari. When the heart is full and the divinity strikes, words fail to come out of your mouth. Oh my Sai, this is a revealing incident that Swami is none other than the Divine Mother. Sairam.